हरि ओम ओम सहनावतु सहनौ भुनक्त सह वीरकवाह तेजस्वीनावधीतमस्तु मा विषावह शातिशाशा हरि ओम श्री गुरुभ्यो नम हरि ओम हरि ओम वेलकम टू दिस ओला संस्कृत साहित्य रसास्वाद सीरीज सो लास्ट टाइम वी वेर सीइंग दैट फोर्थ एक्ट वी कंप्लीटेड एंड व्हाट विल बी देयर इन द फिफ्थ एक्ट द लास्ट एंड द कंक्लूडिंग एक्ट and uh, the praveshaka before the act the main scene starts there is a praveshaka this is a dialogue between only two servants one is the maid one is the uh, servant of dharini called uh, sarasaka he is a male kubja you know with a hunchback uh, he works in the harem and the another is uh, madhukarika the udyanapalika we already know that uh, pancharatra abhyantare you know the ashok has put forth blossoms and therefore this uh, nagarpa this uh, madhukarika she is uh, doing the vedika bandha for that ashok tree okay and she is going to queen dharini to report it to her and she is asking where are you going by the way sarasaka and sarasaka says that he is going to give सम दक्षिणा टू द पुरोहित टू बी गिवन टू दक्षिणीय दैट इज दोज हू डिजर्व दक्षिणा सो ही सेज यदा प्रभृति श्रुत सेनापति यज्ञतुरंगरक्षण नियुक्त भर्तृदारक वसुमित्र तदा प्रभृति तस् आयुर्निमित्त अष्टादश सुवर्ण परिमाण दक्षिणा देवी दक्षिणीय परिग्राहयति, ओके सो दिस इज व्हाट सारसक रिमार्क्स दैट सेनापति हियर रिफर्स टू किंग पुष्यमित्र व्हाई ही इज कंटिन्यूड टू बी कॉल्ड सेनापति बिकॉज ही वाज द सेनापति अर्लियर ऑफ द मौर्य किंग्स इवन द लास्ट किंग बृहद्रथ हु ही गॉट किल्ड बिकॉज ही वाज अ टिरंट यू नो ही वॉज अ सेनापति and therefore he is still known as senapati though he has become a king now okay so this is something called brahmana shramana nyaya brahmana shramana nyaya this is a famous nyaya suppose there is a brahmana and he adopts for some reason the shramana dharma the shramana dharma could be buddhism or jainism you know these are the two parallel uh, what you can say traditions in indian philosophy one is the brahmanical tradition and one is the shramana tradition brahmanical tradition are the apara vidya or uh, the vedas the vedangas the upavedas from our ashtadasha vidya sthanani and the shramana tradition has given rise to jainism first and then buddhism suppose there is a brahmana who has you know embraced jainism or buddhism for some reasons because that was a move you know by by the kings also because it got raja shraya and therefore many people got converted into shramana dharma uh, during those particular period in those particular times so though he become shramana he is known by his earlier name that is called brahmana shramana nyaya for example if i am a professor in the university though i retire people call me professor right like we say ex or a former professor and head and something like that so once that gets stuck to your name you are known by that and therefore this pushyamitra is still known as senapati though he is a king 
ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ಸೇನಾಪತಿನ ಯಜ್ಞತುರಂಗ ರಕ್ಷಣೆ ಸೊ ಯಜ್ಞತುರಂಗ ರಕ್ಷಣೆ ಟು ಪ್ರೊಟೆಕ್ಟ್ ದ ಸ್ಯಾಕ್ರಿಫಿಷಿಯಲ್ ಹಾರ್ಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಇನ್ ವಿಚ್ ಸ್ಯಾಕ್ರಿಫೈಸ್ ದ ಹಾರ್ಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಟು ಬಿ ಪ್ರೊಟೆಕ್ಟೆಡ್ ಇನ್ ಅಶ್ವಮೇಧ ರೈಟ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದೇರ್ ಫರ್ ಸೊ ಯು ಗೆಟ್ ಆಲ್ ದೀಸ್ ರೆಫರೆನ್ಸಸ್ ಥ್ರೂ ದ ಡಯಲಾಗ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಹ್ಯಾರ ಓಕೆ ಟು ಥ್ರೂ ದ ಸರ್ವೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಡಯಲಾಗ್ಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಕಾನ್ವರ್ಸೇಷನ್ ಸೊ ಯಜ್ಞತುರಂಗ ರಕ್ಷಣೆ ನಿಯುಕ್ತ ಭರತೃಧಾರಕ ವಸುಮಿತ್ರ ದ ರಾಜಪುತ್ರ ಕಾಲ್ಡ್ ವಸುಮಿತ್ರ ಅಗ್ನಿಮಿತ್ರ ಸನ್ ಈಸ್ ಅಪಾಯಿಂಟೆಡ್ ಟು ಪ್ರೊಟೆಕ್ಟ್ ದ ಸ್ಯಾಕ್ರಿಫಿಷಿಯಲ್ ಹಾರ್ಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದೇರ್ ಫರ್ ತಸ್ಯ ಆಯುರ್ ನಿಮಿತ್ತ ಫಾರ್ ಹಿಸ್ ಲೈಫ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಫಾರ್ ಹಿಸ್ ವಿಕ್ಟರಿ ಅಷ್ಟಾದಶ ಸುವರ್ಣ ಪರಿಮಾಣ ದಕ್ಷಿಣ ದೇವಿ ದಕ್ಷಿಣೀಯೈ ಪರಿಗ್ರಾಹಯತಿ ಸೊ ದಟ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ದ ಕ್ವೀನ್ ಡಿಸ್ ಬರ್ಸಸ್ ಅಷ್ಟಾದಶ ಸುವರ್ಣ ಪರಿಮಾಣ ದಕ್ಷಿಣ ಅ ದಕ್ಷಿಣ ಸಮಥಿಂಗ್ ಇನ್ ಚಾರಿಟಿ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಸುವರ್ಣ ವಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದಟ್ ಅಷ್ಟಾದಶ ಪರಿಮಾಣ ಅಷ್ಟಾದಶ ಪರಿಮಾಣ ಈಸ್ ದ ಪಾಠ ಆಕ್ಸೆಪ್ಟೆಡ್ ಬೈ ಎಮ್ ಆರ್ ಕಾಳಿ ಓಕೆ ದೇರ್ ಈಸ್ ಅನದರ್ ಪಾಠ ಐ ಫೀಲ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಬೆಟರ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದ್ಯಾಟ್ ಪಾಠ ಈಸ್ ನಿಷ್ಕಶತ ಸುವರ್ಣ ದಕ್ಷಿಣ ನಿಷ್ಕಶತ ನಿಷ್ಕಶತ ನಿಷ್ಕ ಈಸ್ ದ ಕಾಯಿನ್ ಓಕೆ ಸುವರ್ಣ ಕಾಯಿನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಈಸ್ ಅ ಸೊ ಸುವರ್ಣ ಮುದ್ರ ಹೌ ಮೆನಿ ಹಂಡ್ರೆಡ್ ಸೊ ಹಂಡ್ರೆಡ್ ಸುವರ್ಣ ಮುದ್ರಾಸ್ ಶಿ ಈಸ್ ಡೊನೇಟಿಂಗ್ ಎವ್ರಿ ಡೇ ಟು ದ ಡಿಸರ್ವಿಂಗ್ ಬ್ರಾಹ್ಮಣಸ್ ಡಿಸರ್ವಿಂಗ್ ಪ್ರೀಸ್ ಫಾರ್ ದ ಲೈಫ್ ಆಫ್ ವಸುಮಿತ್ರ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ಅದರ್ವೈಸ್ ಇಫ್ ಯು ಟೇಕ್ ಅಷ್ಟಾದಶ ಪರಿಮಾಣ ಪರಿಮಾಣ ಈಸ್ ಅ ಮೇಜರ್ ರೈಟ್ ದೆನ್ ವಾಟ್ ಡಸ್ ಅಷ್ಟಾದಶ ಮೀನ್ ಅಷ್ಟಾದಶ ಈಸ್ ಏಯ್ಟೀನ್ ಏಯ್ಟೀನ್ ಮೇಜರ್ ದೆನ್ ಇಟ್ ಕುಡ್ ಬಿ ಸಮಥಿಂಗ್ ಐ ಐ ಡೋಂಟ್ ನೋ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಐ ಆಮ್ ನಾಟ್ ಎನ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪರ್ಟ್ ಇನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಸುವರ್ಣ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಆಲ್ ದೀಸ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ಬಟ್ ದೆನ್ ಯು ನೋ ಲೈಕ್ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಫೋರ್ಟೀನ್ ಕ್ಯಾರಟ್ ಮೇ ಬಿ ಅಷ್ಟಾದಶ ಕುಡ್ ಬಿ ದ ಕ್ಯಾರಟ್ ಯು ನೋ ದ ದ ವಾಟ್ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಸೇ ದ ಕ್ವಾಲಿಟಿ ದ ಕ್ವಾಲಿಟಿ ಆಫ್ ಸುವರ್ಣ ಬಟ್ ಹೌ ಮೆನಿ ವಿ ಡೋಂಟ್ ನೋ ರೈಟ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದೇರ್ ಫಾರ್ ಐ ಫೀಲ್ ಸಮಟೈಮ್ಸ್ ಯು ನೋ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಎವ್ರಿ ಡೇ ಗಿವಿಂಗ್ ಸುವರ್ಣ ದಕ್ಷಿಣ ಹಂಡ್ರೆಡ್ ಸುವರ್ಣ ಮುದ್ರಾಜ ದಕ್ಷಿಣ ದ್ಯಾಟ್ ದ್ಯಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ವೆರಿ ಲಾಜಿಕಲ್ ಇಸ್ ಇಂಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಸೊ ಸಮಟೈಮ್ಸ್ ದೋ ಐ ಐ ಫಾಲೋ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಐ ಟ್ರಸ್ಟ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಐ ಅಪ್ರಿಷಿಯೇಟ್ ಎಮ್ ಆರ್ ಕಾಳೆ ಸಮಟೈಮ್ಸ್ ವಿ ಫೀಲ್ ಯು ನೋ ದ ಅದರ್ ಪಾಠರ್ಸ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಕುಡ್ ಬಿ ದ ಬೆಟರ್ ರೆಂಡರಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ರೈಟ್ ಬೆಟರ್ ವೆರಿಯೇಷನ್ಸ್ ಸೊ ದಟ್ಸ್ ವೈ ಐ ರೆಡ್ ದಿಸ್ ಔಟ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದೆನ್ ಯುಜ್ಯತೆ ಸೊ ಕ್ವ ಇದಾನಿಂ ದೇವಿ ಅನುತಿಷ್ಠತಿ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಶಿ ಈಸ್ ಸಿಟ್ಟಿಂಗ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಧರ್ಮಾಸ ಇನ್ ದ ಮಂಗಲ ಗೃಹ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ವೀರಸೇನೇನ ವೀರಸೇನ ಈಸ್ ಧಾರಿಣ್ಯ ವರ್ಣಾವರ ಭ್ರಾತ ದ್ಯಾಟ್ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಕಮ್ ಅಕ್ರಾಸ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಆಕ್ಟ್ ಸೊ ವೀರಸೇನೇನ ಪ್ರೇಷಿತ ಲೇಖಂ ಲೇಖಕಾರೈ ವಾಚ್ಯಮಾನ ಸೊ ದ ಲೇಖಕಾರ ದ ಸ್ಕ್ರೈಬ್ಸ್ ಯು ನೋ ದ ಸ್ಕ್ರೈಬ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ದ ರಾಯಲ್ ಫ್ಯಾಮಿಲಿ ದ ಕ್ಲರ್ಕ್ಸ್ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಸೇ ದ ಕ್ಲರ್ಕ್ ಈಸ್ ರೀಡಿಂಗ್ ಔಟ್ ದ್ಯಾಟ್ ಫಾರ್ ಹರ್ ಅಗೇನ್ ಯು ನೋ ದೇರ್ ಮೇ ಬಿ ಸಮ್ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಹೂ ವುಡ್ ಸೇ ಓ ದ್ಯಾಟ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಕ್ವೀನ್ ಧಾರಿಣಿ ಕೆನಾಟ್ ರೀಡ್ ಇಸ್ ದಟ್ ಸೋ ಐ ಮೀನ್ ದ ಕಿಂಗ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಇನ್ ದ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಆಕ್ಟ್ ಇಫ್ ಯು ರಿಮೆಂಬರ್ ಹೀ ಈಸ್ ಸೀಟೆಡ್ ಆನ್ ಹಿಸ್ ಥ್ರೋನ್ ಆನ್ ದ ಇನ್ ದ ಧರ್ಮಾಸನ ಓಕೆ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದೇರ್ ಕಮ್ಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಮಿನಿಸ್ಟರ್ ವಾಹತಕ ವಿತ್ ದ ವಿತ್ ದ ಪತ್ರ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಹೀ ರೀಡ್ಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಡಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಮೀನ್ ದಟ್ ಅಗ್ನಿಮಿತ್ರ ಕಾಂಟ್ ರೀಡ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದ್ಯಾಟ
uh, act at the end of the play, right? So the first act began with the Veera Sena's, uh, I mean, uh, the Yadnya Sena Vidarbha Raja's Patra. Uh, if you remember right, uh, Veera Se, uh, Veera Se, and Vahataka is reading out the letter that uh, Vidarbha Raja, that is Yadnya Sena, he has held captive Madhava Sena, who is coming to King Agnimitra uh, with some sambandha of his sister, and that is Malavika, is it not? And in the uh, in 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 between on the way en route, he was captivated by Yadnya Sena and put in jail. And Viplave uh, Tasya Sodari Yanashta. Okay. So Tasya Anvatasyaha Anveshanaya Prayatishi. That is what the Vidarbhanatha had written. But I will release that Madhava Sena only if Maurya Sachiva, who is in your captivation, you release him, then I will release. So there is a barter, there is an exchange. And then the king is not at all happy with that. And he asks Veera Sena to invade that kingdom and get him defeated and release Madhava Sena and all that. So that has to be conveyed to us now. Okay. So, Kim Punaha Vidarbha Raja Vrittantaha Vashi Kritaha Kila. King Agnimitra has a very strong army and this Vidarbhanatha is a newly established kingdom and therefore Unmulayitum Sushakyam. Therefore, Vashikritaha Kilavira Sena Pramukhaihi Bhartuhu Vijaya Dandaihi Vidarbhanatha. Vashikritaha Vidarbhanatha. So he has been defeated, not killed, he has been defeated by the Vijaya Danda. Danda is the Anika or the Chamu or the Sena by the victorious army of the king. King, uh, Vidarbha, king of Vidarbha has been defeated. And Mochitaha Chasya Dayadaha Madhava Sena. Who is Madhava Sena? His Pitruvya Putra, his cousin. So Mochitaha, he has been released. Dutaha Chatena. So Dutaha Tena Preshitaha. Vidarbhanatha has sent a messenger with what? Mahasarani Ratna Vahanani Shilpakarika Bhuishtam Parijanamcha Upayani Kritya Dutaha Preshitaha. So when the defeated king has to send his messenger, he will send, you know, so many things to the victorious king as a Dakshina. That is his Dakshina. Okay? <laughs> because you have left me alive, you know, I am still alive by your grace. So, he would send him Suvarna, Ratha, uh, then Gaja, then some Sevikas, some dancers and this and that. Shilpakarika Bhuyishtam Parijanam. So, a host of Parijana abounding in artists. Now, this is important for the last thing. Okay. So, Udhyana Palika Anutishtam Anutishthatmanahan Yoga Mahamapi Devim Prekshishye. So, these are the three main things we come across. One is the Ashoka has put forth uh, uh, flowers and the Udhyana Palika Madhukarika has done a Vedika Bandha and she is going to call uh, this one, Dharini for that. Secondly, Yadnya se, uh, this uh, Yadnya Turaga is being protected by uh, uh, Vasumitra. So, Vasumitra is an old enough uh, son of Agnimitra who can be sent on the battlefield and he is accompanying his grandpa, okay, uh, Pushyamitra. And Pushyamitra is performing an Ashwamedha. This is the second thing. And the third thing is Vidarbhanatha is defeated and uh, tomorrow, that is next day, soon, king will be seeing the Dutta officially, okay? And so many things will be resolved once the Parijana would come to the court of the king, okay? Then the Pratihari comes and announces the main scene, but before that, Adnyaptasmi Ashoka Satkara Vyaprataya Devya Vidnyapayarya Putram Ichami Arya Putrena Saha Ashokasya Prasuna Lakshmim Pratyakshi Kartum. Tad Yavad dharmasana gatam devam pratipalayami. So he is still in the dharmasana. The first act started with king on the dharmasana, on the seat of judgment, on his throne. The last act also starts with that. Okay. And now the king is being praised by the Vaitalikas. 
Vaitalikas, general meaning, lexical meaning is Bhatas, Magadhas, Charana, Bandijana, etc., etc., you know. So, these are basically the bards who, who praise the kings, you know, and uh, uh, Vaitalika in that is a special type of uh, uh, singer, a, praise, uh, a praiseworthy person, not praiseworthy person, a praiser of, uh, of the king who, uh, know, who lets him know the time of the day, what is the time of the night, you know, the king has to retire to his uh, um, Shayana Kaksha and get some sleep and morning also he is Pratibodhayat Janaha. So, he is the person who wakes him up. These are the people who praise the Lord, you know, whenever he is seated, you know, when there is like uh, the king comes to the, uh, comes to the Raja Sabha, then his entry is proclaimed, there is an announcement like Chhatrapati Shivaji Maharaj, you know, Praudha Purandhara, this, that, you know, so many things like that. So like that he is being praised and then when he is seated, then also there are some praises. That is Vaitalika. Vaitalika has the word Vetala in it, isn't it? Vetala is a, Vetala is who? The ghost or, you know, so, so he is basically a person who belongs to Vetala. He is the Sevaka of Vaitala. Vaitalika is a Taddhita, right? So Vaitalika as a Taddhita would mean he is a servant, a Sevaka of Vaitala. Okay. Now Vaitala is uh, like a ghostly world, not the human, but semi-human. And therefore, he can work miracles, magic. So Vaitalika's another meaning is a magician. And Andrajalika, that is another meaning. If you go to the etymology of that, then Vitala and Vaitala. Vitala, Vividhaha, Talaha. Vividhena, Talena, Charati, Asau, Vaitalikaha. One who adopts various talas, various beads, when he sings the praises of the king. So that is the meaning which we want here. It is not an Indra Jalika. He is not a magician. Okay. He is not a Sevaka of Vaitala. He is the bard who can uh, resort to different, different ragas, different, different talas and sing the praises of the king. So there are two Vaitalikas. Normally there are two. And so that we get Vividha Tala here also, right? But uh, unfortunately or fortunately, both these verses are in the same meter, Harini meter. Okay. Dishtya Dandena uh, Arishirasu Vartate Devaha. Dishtya is congratulations. Dishtya Vartatam Bhavan. Oh, you may grow, not height. Huh? You may grow, may your fame, may your yasha grow. So, Dishtya Dandena Arishirasu Vartate Devaha. Dandena, with your army, you have, you know, you have, uh, you are sitting on the top of your Aris, your foes, your enemies. That means you have subdued all your enemies. A very beautiful verse, this one especially is a very beautiful verse. I will say this for every verse. Parabhrita kalavyahareshu tvam atharatihi madhum nayasi vidisha tire tira udhyaneshu ananga iva angavan. Vijaya karinam, we'll read only the first two lines and let me explain that. This will require some sort of explanation. I mean, every verse of Kalidasa needs that because there are two, two meanings sometimes. There is upama. Uh, there is Upama based on uh, Shlesh also. Uh, here, the king is called as Anangaha Iva Angavan. There is Upama. He is having limbs and body, but he is like Ananga. Ananga is the god of love, Madana. He was rendered to Ananga by Lord Shiva, who burnt him to ashes, you know, in the Kumara Sambhava, the Madana Daha Prakarana. So, Madana became Ananga since then, but 
he is very beautiful he is very handsome so the king is handsome like ananga king is passionate full and filled with the feeling of love like ananga ananga's love is rati his wife there is the word tvam atratihi atratihi anangaha yatha madhumasam nayati tatha anangaha iv kintu angavan agnimitrah विदिशातीरोद्यानेशु परभृतकलव्याहारेशु मधुमासम चैत्रमासम वसंत ऋतु नयति इति सारांशः गॉट द मीनिंग एज एंड फॉर द अनंग फॉर द मदन परभृतकलव्याहार गोज वेरी वेल बिकॉज मधुमास इज वसंत ऋतु चैत्रमास बेसिकली but madhu and madha word together make vasanta ritu right and therefore in the vasanta ritu there has to be parabhrita that is kokila kala sweet madhura vyahara kujana kala is sweet vyahara v plus a plus ru is to utter that is the speech that is for kaku it is not a speech these are the sweet notes of the kakus so how does the adanga pass on his madhumasa with the parabrita kala vyahareshu and where this parabrita kala vyahara happens vidisha tira upanta vidisha tira udyaneshu in the in the upavanas in the gardens the pleasure gardens of vidisha nagari when the kakus are cooing very sweetly with that sweet notes ananga who has obtained rati atta rati prapta atta avapta prapta rati yena sah atta rati anangah yatha madhumasam nayati okay now for uh, agni mitra you can say i mean there is no harm in saying that uh, he also spent his madhumasa in the pramadavana he is going to pramadavana we only saw him two three times and iravati caught him there two three times in pramadavana and samudra griha right so vidisha tiro dhyaneshu the like pramadavaneshu udyaneshu and these udyanas are resonate with the sweet notes of the kakus that is also uh, that is also logical but parabrata will have another meaning and that applies only to king agnimitra paraihi bhritah iti parabhritah by kaku or kokila is called parabhrita everybody knows that the kaku lays its eggs in the nest of the crow to be nourished by the female crow and the kaku is you know free to coo here and there go on the perch on the branch and then just sing sweetly and her children her eggs are being hatched by the crow right crow is a simple bird poor fellow doesn't even recognize that it is not my egg and not my child and therefore the kaku is known as parabrata but paraihi bhritah one who is nurtured and bred and nourished bred b r e d and nourished by others this could be the bhatas right this could be the bhatas because they are dependent on the king for their salary for their living is it not so parabhrita kala vyahareshu so these are the sweet praises of the bards so there is a pun right so when there is a shlesha otherwise it is not that uh, you know the pun meaning only one meaning is applicable to agnimitra both the meanings are applicable to agnimitra for madana it is kokila and for agnimitra it is kokila kujana plus the singing of the bards because they are also sweet singers vividhaihi talaihi charanti iti vaitalika and plus praise stuti priyo hi manushya who doesn't like to be appreciated and praise so this is very sweet so parabhrita kalavyahareshu attaratihi tvam attaratihi one who has obtained or gained love 
newly this is the new love of agnimitra that is malavika is it not so atarati he can also be rati is the name of the uh, wife of madana okay rati is a person and it goes very well with ananga but atarati he one who takes pleasure simply it could be pleasure okay but this is a special pleasure and special love we know that king is obsessed by the beauty of malavika right and therefore this rati can specially indicate you to malavika so atarati hi madhum nayasi vidishati rodyaneshu ananga iva angavan so you are like madana so handsome so beautiful okay and then so this is his physical beauty and his gallantry his passion his love his lalitya in a way which is being described in the first two lines that emphasizes his dhira lalitatva okay and the second two lines and the second half of the verse that will focus on his dhiro dattatva he is a shura veera king because his army could defeat under his able guidance it is not that every time the king him, himself personally has to go on the battlefield and take his sword and or uh, shoot the arrow it's not it's never like that it's his people but what is important is the guidance the leadership okay so he as a good leader how he fares there okay विजयकरीणा आलानत्वं गतैहि प्रबलस्यते वरद वरदारोधो वृक्षैहि सह अवनतः रिपुः हे वरद ओ यू वन हु गिव्स बून्स टू अदर्स वन हु ब्लेसेस अदर्स वन हु फेवर्स अदर्स वरान ददाति इति वरदः वरद वरदारोधो वृक्षैहि छेकानुप्रास same words it's not only one varna which is getting alliterated the whole word gets alliterated it is called chek anuprasa chek anuprasa so varad varadarodho vrikshaihi sah avanatah ripuh so o varad this is really you know dishtya dishtya bhavan vardhate de arishirassu vartate devah because along with the trees on the banks of the river varada who have bent down who have been bent down your ripu is also bent down and why these trees on the banks of varada are bent down because when agnimitra's army has marched varada is uh, the modern vardha river near nagpur near madhya pradesh you know i mean the border of maharashtra and madhya pradesh this is what vidarbha region is nagpur right vidarbha is nagpur so there flows the river varada that is vardha pravara these are the rivers flowing there so varada is vardha nowadays we call her vardha but it is basically varada varadaini sa nadi so varada rodho vrukshaha avanataah kim karanat बिकॉज विजय करीणाम आलानत्वं गतैहि वरदारोधो वृक्षैहि दीज वृक्षज हैव बीन रेंडर टू द पोस्ट्स टू व्हिच द माइटी विक्टोरियस एलिफेंट्स इन द आर्मी ऑफ अग्निमित्र आर टाइड व्हेन द आर्मी इज मार्चिंग अलोंग विद द गजदल अश्वदल रथदल एंड ऑल दैट वेयर द गजज विल फाइंड द the alana alana is the post uh, to which they are tied with a shrunkala alana is shrunkala alana is shrunkala so alana gatah stambhah it is called karistambhah the stambh okay the the trunk of a tree or you know the dried wooden block which is raised as a pillar to which by shrunkala by the i and chain the elephant is tied so that the elephants won't go here and there one leg of the elephant is tied if you go to see any elephant uh, what you can say elephant garden ne 
where i mean in kerala i have seen so many elephants like this but they are tied to some post you know some stamb so on the way where will they carry all the stambhas the pillars the big huge trees on the banks of varada they are rendered to karistamb okay and to which the elephants are tied now the elephant won't uh, sit there i mean stand there just like that in a disciplined manner you know it will shake his body here and there like this and if you see how elephants play with their feet when they are tied their three feet are not tied only one foot is tied right so they just shake and move the foot like this if you have seen how the elephants are doing krida very lovely sight especially when baby elephants do it you know with their shunda and with their feet dancing like this and because they are doing this the trees how much bhar they can tolerate so they will bend as and when the elephants move and therefore the varada rodho vrukshah avanatah kasmat karana आलानत्वं गताः केशाम आलानत्वं गताः विजयकरिणाम आलानत्वं गताः कस्य विजयकरिणः अग्निमित्रस्य विजयकरिणः सो विजयकरिणाम आलानत्वं गतैः प्रबलस्यते प्रबल बिकॉज ओ किंग यू हैव अ माइटी आर्मी प्रबल बल इज आर्मी or you could you could simply say prabala is you know very valiant very strong so you are strong prabalasyate he varada vijaya karinam alanatvam gataihi varada rodho vrukshaihi avanatah sah avanatah ripuh as the trees were bent down they were caused to bend down because they were used as the post to tie the elephants similarly the ripuhu the enemy is also bent down that means the enemy is parabhuta he is defeated he is bent down this is lakshana he is not that he is bending down his head but he is defeated so so many alankaras are here you see so many alankaras there is shlesha there is upama there is alliteration then uh, there is sahokti in the last two lines varada vruksh uh, varada rodho vrukshaihi sah ripuhu api avanatah sahokti so four alankaras and all these alankaras are mixture without any angangi bhav this is samsrushti okay so so many alankaras very beautiful verse so we'll just read it once so that the meaning becomes very clear to you parabhrita kala vyahareshu tvamattaratihi madhum nayasi vidishati rodyaneshu ananga iva angavan vijaya karinam alanatvam gataihi prabalasyate varada varada rodho vrukshaihi sah avanato ripuh hmm. beautiful so this is sung by van vaitalika now the second vaitalika hum bhi kuch kam nahi he also comes forward to describe the king okay virachita padam veera pritya asuropam sorry veera pritya suropam suribhihi charitam ubhayoho madhye kritya sthitam krathakaishikan tava hritavatah dandani kaihi vidarbha patehe shriyam parigha gurubhihi dorbhihi shaurehe prasai hach rukmini you can identify some words like rukmini here and shauri shauri is who krishna shurasya putra shurasenasya vamshe jatah iti shauri hi nam krishna so krishna rukmini you got a reference here and if you remember rukmini is the vidarbha raja kanya okay she is vidarbha raja kanya the context is of vidarbha so as krishna carried vidarbha from vidarbha rukmini 
you also carried the shri the rajya shri of vidarbha that is simple simple meaning is like that that means king agnimitra is compared here with sakshat bhagavan krishna he is so brave he is so handsome like krishna okay everybody is dear and favorite so these are the two things and this happens in vidarbha for vidarbha there is another name which is used here is krathakaishika krathakaishika they happen to be two sons of one of the kings of vidarbha so kratha and kaishika they happen to be the two sons of the vidarbha nath some time ago and therefore the entire region and the people of the region are called kratha kaishikaha okay now if in my own region somebody suppose we take the example of maharashtra i still belong to maharashtra because 65 years of my life i spent in mumbai okay i am more a maharashtrian so chhatrapati shivaji maharaj bole to you know like that so the region where a person is born maharashtra pune like that you just take the name and everybody is so you know um, you know enthusiastic about singing the glories of their heroes there similarly all the krathakaishikas all the krathakaishikas are singing the glories of whom of krishna who stole away rukmini the vidarbha shri she is also the beauty of vidarbha literally the beauty beauty queen of vidarbha vidarbha rajakanya and it is said that vaidarbhiya striyaha vaidarbhya vaidar or vaidarbhiya striya are very beautiful you know in uh, literature we have got a vaidarbhi style you know there is arabhati style satvati style there is vaidarbhi style vaidarbhi style of uh, literature especially our kalidasa masters that style it is Uh, filled with all soft consonants and alliterative prasad jagunaihi yuktah prasad gunaihi yuktah varnah yujyante sa vaidarbhi shaili okay so he masters that vaidarbhi shaili and therefore it is all soft graceful charming sulalita shaili okay so this is also there for vaidarbha now you join all these dots what happens is the krathakaishikas are singing the glories of those heroes who stole away or took away the vaidarbhi shri now there are two in that so long there was only krishna so long it was only krishna whose adventures were sung by the people and they made so many virachita padam te tasya charitam you know these are the words virachita padam veera pritya those who who compose ballads povada povada you know veera shri yukta veera rasa yukta povada so that is so those who love that type of adventure the bravery and valor of their heroes they normally compose virachita padam what the charita the charita of their heroes so so long it was only krishna who carried away rukmini but now you also joined in that line o agnimitra virachita padam virachita padam charitam by whom suri bhihi suri bhihi kavi bhihi suri here means kavi okay suri could be one who uh, who is you know what you can say um, like purva suri we say the glorious ancestors and all right so kavi here wise kavis you can say so veera pritya suri bhihi charitam virachita padam kim adhikritya kim madhye kritya kratha kaishikan madhye kritya having the subject matter of krathakaishika that is the vaidarbhiya people 
ಕ್ರಥಕೈಶಿಕ ಜಸ್ ನ ವೈ ರಿಫರ್ಡ್ ಟು ಕ್ರಥಕೈಶಿಕ ದ ವೈದರ್ಭೀಯ ಜನಾ ಮಧ್ಯೆ ಕೃತ್ಯ ಕ್ರಥಕೈಶಿಕಾನ್ ವಿರಚಿತ ಪದ ಚರಿತ ಕೇನ ರಚಿತ ಕೇನ ವಿರಚಿತ ಪದ ಸೂರಿಭಿ ಕಸ್ಮಾತ್ ವೀರ ಪ್ರೀತ್ಯ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ದೇ ಲವ್ ದ ಅಡ್ವೆಂಚರ್ಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದೇ ಲವ್ ದ ಬ್ರೇವ್ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದ್ಯಾಟ್ ಚರಿತ ವಿಚ್ ಇಸ್ ಸ್ಥಿತ ವಿಚ್ ಈಸ್ ಬೀಂಗ್ ಸಂಗ್ ದಟ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ದ ಗ್ಲೋರೀಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಅಗ್ನಿಮಿತ್ರ ಹೌ ಬ್ರೇವ್ಲಿ ಹೌ ವ್ಯಾಲರಸ್ಲಿ ಹಿಸ್ ಆರ್ಮಿ ಡಿಫೀಟೆಡ್ ದ ವಿದರ್ಭನಾಥ ಸಚ್ ಸ್ಟೋರೀಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಸಚ್ ಸಾಂಗ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ಬೀಂಗ್ ಸಂಗ್ ಬೈ ದ ಪೋಯಟ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ದ ವಿದರ್ಭ ರೀಜನ್ ಓಕೆ ತವ ಚ ಸುಹುಚ್ಚರಿತ ತವ ಒ ಅಗ್ನಿಮಿತ್ರ ಯುವರ್ಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಋತವತ ಪ್ರಸಹ್ಯ ಚ ರುಕ್ಮಿಣಿ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಒನ್ ಹೂ ಕ್ಯಾರಿಡ್ ಅವೇ ಬಲಾತ್ ಪ್ರಸಹ್ಯ ಬಲಾತ್ ಋತವತ ಕಾಂ ಋತವಾನ್ ಸಹ ರುಕ್ಮಿಣಿ ಕಹ ಋತವಾನ್ ಶೌರಿ ತಸ್ಯ ಶೌರೇ ಚರಿತ ತವ ಚ ಚರಿತ ಓಕೆ ವಿರಚಿತ ಪದ ಸೂರಿಭಿ ನೌ ಯುವರ್ ಚರಿತ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ವರದಾ ರೋಧೋ ವೃಕ್ಷೈ ಸಹ ಅವನತ ರಿಪು ದಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಬೀನ್ ಸ್ಟೇಟೆಡ್ ಬಟ್ ಫಾರ್ ಶೌರಿ ಸಮಥಿಂಗ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಟು ಬಿ ಸ್ಟೇಟೆಡ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದ್ಯಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಸ್ಟೇಟೆಡ್ ಆ್ಯಸ್ ದ ವಿದರ್ಭ ಪತೆ ಹೇ ಶ್ರಿಯಂ ಹ ಪರಿಘ ಗುರುಭಿ ದೋರ್ಭಿ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದೇರ್ ಈಸ್ ಒನ್ ಮೋರ್ ವಿಶೇಷಣ ದಂಡಾನೀಕೈ ದಂಡ ಅನೇಕೈ ದಂಡ ಈಸ್ ಶಾಸನ ಪನಿಷ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಅನೇಕ ಈಸ್ ದ ಸೇನಾ ಅನೇಕ ಚಮು ಬಲ ಓಕೆ ದೀಸ್ ಆರ್ ಆಲ್ ದ ಸಿನಾನಿಮ್ಸ್ ಆ್ಯಸ್ ಸೇನಾ ದ ಆರ್ಮಿ ದ ಆರ್ಮಿ ವಿಚ್ ಈಸ್ ವಿಕ್ಟೋರಿಯಸ್ ದಂಡಾನೀಕೈ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ವಿಚ್ ಈಸ್ ಅ ವಿಕ್ಟೋರಿಯಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಈಸ್ ಅ ವಿಶೇಷಣ ಫಾರ್ ದ್ಯಾಟ್ ದಿಸ್ ವಿಲ್ ಗೋ ವಿತ್ ಬೋತ್ ಅಗ್ನಿಮಿತ್ರ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಶೌರಿ ಓಕೆ ದಂಡಾನೀಕೈ ಹೌ ಇಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಅನೇಕ ದ ಸೇನಾ ಪರಿಘ ಗುರುಭಿ ದೋರ್ಭಿ ದ ಅನೇಕ ದ ಸೇನಾ ವಿಚ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಆಮ್ಸ್ ದೋಹು ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಆಮ್ಸ್ ವಿಚ್ ಆರ್ ಆ್ಯಸ್ ಹೇವಿ ಗುರು ಆ್ಯಸ್ ಪರಿಘ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಆಯನ್ ಬಾರ್ಸ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಆ್ಯಸ್ ಸ್ಟ್ರಾಂಗ್ ಆ್ಯಸ್ ಆಯನ್ ಬಾರ್ಸ್ ದ ಆಮ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದೀಸ್ ವಾರಿಯರ್ಸ್ ಬೀಟ್ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಬೀಟ್ ಅಗ್ನಿಮಿತ್ರ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಫೋರ್ ಆಮ್ಸ್ so dorbhi hi the visheshana goes very well with him and if you say danda nikai hi so many brave soldiers along with veera sena the senapati and agnimitra the leader behind them you know so so many brave arms are there so if you are carrying anything hathat or balat you need that strength that robustness to fight out and face the adversities or the opponents and therefore it these do this do ho these arms should be as strong as unfailing as the iron bars now these iron bars basically parigh parigh is the thing you know in if you see in the olden houses like vada sanskruti old houses palaces palaces and all when the doors are closed there is an iron bar which is slipped along okay especially on the gates of the durgas the forts the main gate the durga dwar there will be an iron bar a flat iron bar which is you know you you can understand you can visualize now in the ilam we have the wooden bars right in our ilam we have the in the uh, houses i mean residential houses it is not iron but in the durga in the forts it will be iron bars to protect because the main dwar the durga dwar was opened by the elephants by striking their temples against the door you know vapra krida parinata gaja prekshaniyam dadarsha that is called vapra krida butting sport it is called b u t t i n g butting sport that is vapra krida the elephants the varahas they are known to do that okay so they normally break it open if it is wooden one the elephants can fail down the trees what is there 
but if it is an iron bar then it will hold the door right so if you want to compare anything uh, for strength then it can't be a wooden bar it has to be iron bar so parigha dor bhihi got the meaning clear so parigha guru bhihi dor bhihi dandani kaihi vidarbha patehe shriyam ritavataha tavacha rukmini mritavataha shaureshcha charitam suri bhihi virachita padam sthitam kamuddishya kratha kaishikan madhye kritya so both of these the agnimitra and krishna has you know uh, they have not has they have stolen or they have carried away the very beauty the very uh, the very what you can say pride of vidarbha when rukmini was carried out the pride of vidarbha was lost when this king is defeated the pride of vidarbha is lost and therefore krathakaishikan madhye kritya all people are singing the glories they have composed verses and songs and ballads not only on krishna but you also so agnimitra is likened to krishna so that heightens his uh, his capacity his personality it elevates him to the godliness is it not it elevates him to the godliness so here also there are so many alankaras uh, there is um, tulya yogita alankara because you and krishna you are both on the same page or on par so there is tulya yogita there is deepaka uh, then there is anuprasa um, and samsrushti of course so all these alankaras mixture there is a samsrushti so very beautiful verses of the vaitalikas you know in fact i wanted to skip the vaitalika verses because that is not uh, uh, directly instrumental in furthering the plot but this is needed because you know agnimitra's personality gives different colors because of this okay esha jaya shabda jaya shabda suchita prasthana bharta itayeva agachati now when the king uh, i mean uh, rises from his dharmasana then also there is uh, lalakari you know the king is coming jaya jaya kar etc so jaya shabdena bharta itayeva agachati aham api tavad asya pramukhat kinchit upasritya i let me get little away from his main path you know he is coming this way so the servants won't come in uh, won't stand in the way you know they will go to little side so alinda toranam samashrita bhavami let me be uh, little behind you know push me uh, push myself behind a alinda torana iti iti ha iti tatra sthita tata pravishati sa vayasya raja so now the main scene starts and the king enters raja says again a very nice uh, uh, verse with vishama and sahopti and two alankaras kantam vichitya sulabhe tar samprayogam shrutva vidarbha pati mam anamitam balaischa dhara abhirata paiva abhihatam sarojam dukhayate charudayam sukhamashnute cha there are two news you know one news is that iravati caught him there along with malavika and she is red hot she is angry so he is uh, worried about what will happen to malavika now last time when she caught him like that malavika was jailed nigadabaddha now what will happen now and therefore dukha yate chardayam thinking of that poor girl you know his heart really melts and sinks but on the other hand there is a very good news that vidarbhanatah avanatah ripuhu avanatah and therefore his heart is very uh, what you can say Mm, uh, i mean his moral got boosted up and his heart is relishing and rejoicing the victory at the same time both these things are happening like a lotus which you know in the in the in the rains with the streams of the rains the pouring down rains it will shut down you know but if it sees some little little what you say uh, the the heat of the sun because the kamalana kamalini they blossom 
by the sun ray divakara kiranai nalini eva vikasati right and therefore uh, if a kamala gets beaten by the showers it will be mlana but at the same time little ray of sun ray of sun touches it and it wants to blossom right so this is like kamala my heart rit kamala hridaya is always compared to kamala right rit kamala my heart is also facing both these things simultaneously kantam vichitya sulabhetar samprayogam kantam she is not wife she is not bharya but she is kanta kamyate iti kanta i still love her and therefore till i own her i can't call her bharya so she is kanta kantam vichitya how is her how is she sulabha itara samprayogam sulabha itara that is a sulabha sulabhe tara samprayogam that is to have her to obtain her is not easy it is difficult because so many obstacles so many impediments i have faced so long right sulabhe tara samprayogam so uh, kantam vichintya thinking of that kanta who can be obtained by me with great difficulty there are so many obstacles this is like a hurdle race for me i have to cross every hurdle every time every moment this is a hurdle race so sulabhe tara samprayoga at the same time shrutva having heard vidarbha patim anamitam balaischa having heard that my army has subdued the vidarbha pati dhara bhihi atape iva abhihatam sarojam dukhayate charadayam sukhamashnute cha so my heart sinks and the same time rejoices with joy as a lotus will sink in the showers of the rain but rejoice and bloom at the ray of the sun okay dhara bhihi atape iva abhihatam dhara bhihi abhihatam and atape iva the kamala is in atape it has to bloom but at the moment it is being beaten up slashed by the downpour of rains okay so dhara bhihi abhihatam atapasthitam iva sarojam mam hridayam dukhayate sukhamashnute cha so beautiful alankaras upama and kavyalinga and so many things and vishama vishama alankara okay so yatha aham pashyami as i see tatha ekanta sukhito bhavan bhavishyati vidushaka he is always you know accompanying the king he always dhiraj bandhata hai usko dhadas bandhata hai you know always uh, uh, what uplifts his sinking nature you know so as i see o oh friend ekanta sukhito bhavishyati you will be absolutely happy ekanta sukhita that is the only goal there is no other way absolutely happiness is there in store for you katham eva how do you say that athakila devya pandita kaushiki bhanita i heard devi dharini talking to pandita kaushiki parivrajika bhagavati yatvam prasadana garvam vahasi tad darshaya मालविकायाः शरीरे वैदर्भ विवाह नेपथ्यम इति व्हाट डिड क्वीन धारिणी से टू परिव्राजिका दैट यू ऑल बिलोंग टू विदर्भ किंग नो माधवसेन वाज कॉट यू नो सो माधवसेन इज हर ब्रदर दे आर दे हैव कम फ्रॉम देयर सो इफ यू हैव दैट यू नो प्राइड दैट विदर्भ इज यू नो इट एक्सेल्स इन ऑल द थिंग्स ऑल द ग्रैंजर्स all the prasadana kala vaidarbhiya prasadana kala is the best if you boast of that then why don't you deck bedeck this malavika in the bridal dress which is the best of the vidarbha you know the prasadana kala if you boast of your prasadana kala we already see in that pandita kaushiki is the best judge for the dance and the singing as well that sharmishthayah chatushpadi and that chalita nritya prakar you know the way she has given comments it really shows her her expertise in that 
so if you are really an expert and if you boast of your expertise then just put that bridal makeup on malavika let me see how skilled you are how expert you are and why i mean that itself is a good sign you know that itself is a good sign staya cha sa vishesha alankrita malavika and parivrajika took it up as a task as a challenge and she has already uh, decked malavika in vivah nepathya nepathya we have seen nepathya the meaning of nepathya is costume so virala nepathya you know that was the thing which was there in the first act in the second act right so virala nepathyam virala nepathyam praveshaya so taya cha sa vishesha alankrita malavika tatra bhavati kadachit uh, पूरयेद भवतापि मनोरथम आई फील दैट यू नो अदरवाइज वाई शुड मालविका बी डेक्ट एज अ ब्राइड दैट मीन्स आई फील दैट धारिणी इज प्लैनिंग टू गिव हर इन मैरेज टू यू हर हैंड इन योर हैंड्स पूरयेद भवतापि मनोरथम युअर विश विल बी फुलफिल्ड एंड राजा से सखे मदपेक्षा निवृत्त्या निवृत्ते निवृत्त ईर्षाया धारिण्या पूर्वचरित संभाव्य यस इट इज वेरी प्रॉबेबल हि सेज बिकॉज पूर्वचरित इन द पास्ट ऑल्सो शी हेज डेवलप दिस मैग्नानिमिटी ऑफ हार्ट फ्रॉम वेर जेलसी इज ड्रिवन आउट यू नो जेलसी मैलिस एंड ऑल सो निवृत्त ईर्षाया दैट थ्रोज लाइट ऑन द ऑन द कैरेक्टरिस्टिक ऑफ धारिणी you know though apparently she was little annoyed when agnimitra showed his liking for malavika it was more because malavika she conceived or she saw as a dasi right because now when malavika's real identity is revealed you will see i mean we will see we'll read that how dharini feels so sad and so sorry for having treated her as a maid servant one who deserves to be a queen i treated her as a maid servant so this was more because of that otherwise you know the king getting married to the many women whom he loves was was not a new thing in the harem and dharini was used to perhaps iravati who was the younger queen she got iravati married to king in the same fashion so same fashion now she is doing this so purva charitaihi sambhavyate etat that is indicative enough okay uh, pratihari upagamya jayatu bharta devi vidnyapayati so devi is uh, requesting तपनीय अशोक से कुसुम सौभाग्य दर्शन सरंभ सफल क्रियता सो ई वॉन्ट टू सी दट प्रसून लक्ष्मी आर्यपुत्रेण सह प्रत्यक्षी कर्तुम इच्छा दट वॉज हर विश् सो यू प्लीज अकंपनी मी टू सी दट कुसुम वैभव कुसुम सौभाग्य ननु त्र देवी ओ इच्छी नियर द तपनीय अशोक अथ किम येस देवी इज वेरी मच देर यथार्ह सम्मान सुखितमंतपुर विसृज्य मालविका पुरो गणेन आत्मन परिजन सह देव प्रतिपालयति शी इज वेटिंग फॉर यू देर विथ मालविका पुरो गणेन परिजन विथ ऑल हर रेटिन्यू इन फ्रंट ऑफ द रेटिन्यू इज मालविका मालविका पुरो गणेन मालविका इज इन द फ्रंट so keeping malavika in the front and with her retinue she is waiting for you there and before that she has already given the sanmana to yatharham antapuram you know all the sevak and sevika because her favorite tree ashoka has put forth blossoms and therefore it is like a putra janma for her and therefore she is very happy and uh, now next time we'll meet uh, how you know uh, this dharini and uh, malavika iravati is absent iravati will not come here for very obvious reasons because you know it was very un uh, uh, untoward situation in which iravati has been uh, like intruding in the in the privacy of the king so she has no right to be there now right 
so that is a poetic justice and therefore of course she has given her uh, good wishes for uh, dharini she has already sent uh, uh, you know when that uh, maid servant came and uh, asked uh, iravati that dharini is asking about malavika and then she said you do whatever you like because on your prasad only ayam janaha you know this person uh, rests on you only your prasad only so that means she has also taken out malice from her heart now dharini is nivrutta irsha we already seen so all good things are there in store for us for the king as well okay so with this we'll uh, stop here om purnamada purnamidam purnat purnamudachyate purnasya purnamadaya पूर्णमेवशिष्यते ओं शाति 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 हरि ओं श्रीगुरुभ्यो नम हरि ओं